Today I'm going to teach you a fun little quick way to make an extra bit of silver or to have an exciting adventure. It's one of the two. It can't technically be both. So I'm going to go ahead and buy and equip this set here. And here we go. So let me explain what I'm about to do. I am in the Bridgewatch portal zone to the black zone. And we're going to make a little trip to Arthur's Rest. Now if you're in any other town... Like, for instance, if you're from Martlock, you would make your adventure, it looks like, also to Arthur's Rest, possibly. Uh, if you're up here in Thetford, for whatever reason, no one ever goes to Thetford. You would go to Morgana's Rest, and so on and so forth. So, what we're doing is we have two invisibil bleh, invisibility potions and a quick little gank set uh, with a beef stew. And what we're doing is we are going to not take that invisibility shrine, we are going to ride towards Arthur's Rest... And if we see a player, we are going to attempt to kill them. Now, this kit that I'm wearing, it only costs 40,000 silver. And yes, I know I don't have an offhand or a cape or a bag. That's intentional, to lower the cost of the kit. So, what we're doing now is we are just out looking for trouble. We're looking for adventure. We're looking for a fight. And if we encounter one, preferably a person by themselves, which almost never happens in the Black Zone, we... We'll dismount off screen. Looks like there's a trouble up ahead. There's also a blob. So now blobs, you don't want to just ride into a blob and die, okay? Uh, because you're just giving away 40,000 silver. You can't really technically kill someone and get away with it when they're in a blob like that. So you do have to kind of watch out for that and avoid the blob. Anyway, so our goal right now is to try to find someone off like fame farming or skinning or something or harvesting and dismount off screen and then approach them while invisible and then try to kill them without them escaping. Or we just might encounter a big fight along the way and uh, maybe get some loot out of it on our way to Arthur's Rest. If we get a lot of loot, we're going back to Bridgewatch Portal via the Journey Home method. But if we make it with our gear and we don't drink our potions or, you know, lose anything, they're all mounted up, it's fine. Okay, looks like a few of them inspected me there, but no one's following. If we make it to Arthur's Rest with this kit, I'm going to show you just how much silver we're going to make out of it. Okay, this weapon here, it has a market value of 3,800. This this weapon sells for 15,000 at Arthur's Rest. Uh, this armor is like 2,000 because it's just a flat four. It's super cheap, but at Arthur's Rest, it's like six or 7,000, okay? You get where I'm going with this? Now, we're not going to try to dismount a mounted player. That is not what this build is for. That is not what this build specializes in. Our build specifically is meant to go invisible, stand next to someone, and then try to blow them up as fast as possible before they can react to us. And then we can grab their loot. You can also check bodies along the way, see if there's anything you might like. That guy didn't have anything, though, unfortunately. Now, we're on the mule because the mule is cheap, okay? The mule is only worth 7,000 market value. This thing will go for eight to 10,000 at Arthur's Rest. Our boots and helmet, same thing. If we don't eat our food, that's another extra 2K right there. So we're looking to make at least 20,000 silver per trip. Now, I know that's not a lot of silver, but it's not about making a profit. It, I'm, this is not a video about transporting stuff to Arthur's Rest to flip. No, this is trying to get out and do some actual PvP against other players. And you might be thinking, well, if you want to do real PvP, you got to wear better gear, bro. It's like, no, I don't. But there's a lot of dismounted players up in that corner. See, there's multiples of them, though. So what that means is that I can't technically safely approach. They're, looks like they're guarding the gate. And that guy dismounted on me there. He's a bolt caster guy. He can dismount me very quickly. He, he missed, though. So, again, this is just gaining experience. Now, this guy, is he is he running? Oh, there's another guy. I gotta juke this. I could actually probably fight him. I was unable to juke. I'm gonna go invisible here and charge up nothing because invisibility did not work. <laughs> so, I'm probably dead here. And, yeah, there's a, it's 2v1. Invisibility potion because I don't want them to eat it. I'm gonna eat the stew. Didn't eat the stew in time. But they didn't get that invisibility potion from me. And this is a... Well, I guess this is a failed video, because, um, I don't know. <laughs> I was kind of hoping that, uh, you know, things would go a little bit better. <laughs> but hey, it's not a big deal, okay? Sometimes you kill people with this with this little build, with this little setup. It only costs 40000 You know, it's not a lot of money. 
I literally logged into 1.7 million today, and I'm sitting on another million in the market waiting to sell. So it's not a big deal. You know, you just go here, you just rebuy, and you go back out. Uh, why do I try? Everyone's like, do Black Zone content, Solvigi. This is why I don't do it. Just get murdered. Just get killed by, like, was it three dudes? Grats on the... It, it was 40k, I chugged a potion, though, so it's only 30k now. Look at this guy, he's just out here boxing people. <laughs> With his 10 million friends ready and waiting. Alright, so uh, we're, we're riding towards a blob right now, that's not good. <laughs> that guy's dismounted, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk away from that. That guy also behind me is dismounted. Man, this is a quick one. <laughs> Might have to invisibility shrine out. I was kind of trying to show how much money you could flip, you know, going to Arthur's Rest. You'll just have to take my word for it. We might not make it in today's video. Ah, oh, man. This... See, I, I like to make videos that are, like, useful to people, that are handy, that help newbies out, that maybe someone who's been playing a while, that they might get something out of it. And telling people to go to the Black Zone for adventure, man, it's, uh... Why? Yeah, see, if I was new, that 40k, you know, that would hurt. You know, that's like 20 minutes of farming rocks or something, man. But, uh, you know, for me, it ain't no big deal. It's whatever. <laughs> uh, and you could be like, well, why don't you eat the beef stew before you ride out? And and the, is this the, this is the same map in it? Maybe it is? I don't know. But the reason is because if I don't get into a single fight or see a single target along the way, then the beef stew can be sold for basically double. Yeah, this is the same map because that's where I died. So that means these dudes are still out here. <laughs> we'll have to go a little bit around, I guess, and not take the roads. But see, the whole point, see, there's a guy there, he's mounted. We're looking for dismounted solo players, which, again, it's super, super rare. Look at all these dead bodies, though. Look at them. Anything good? Ooh. What do we got? Well, that's, that's good. That's worth, <laughs> that's worth more than what I'm wearing. Whoa, now, I'm getting attacked. Okay, mount up. Mount up. <laughs> and we're not gonna... Is, is, are they gonna kill my mount? Oh, 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 almost. Okay, so we're obviously... Um, we won here. How much is my journey back? 14k. So that's 50k profit. Why didn't they loot this? I don't know. But hey, that's that's adventure number one succeeding. We uh, we just made our kit back, okay? So we're, we're in the green, guys. <laughs> I spent 8 minutes and made 20k, that sucks. That is absolute- The thing is, like, I've always advocated against the Black Zone because it's a waste of time, right? But I guess if you're having fun with it, you know, maybe, kinda? If you're having fun with it, why not? Anyway, let's just quick sell all this stuff, you know, just whatever, just quick sell it. Get it out of our inventory so we can ride back out into the sunset once again. Here we go. I mean, hey, it's money. It's not a lot of money. It's not even really worth it for someone like me to stop and pick up. It obviously wasn't worth it for the gankers to pick up that 40k right there. Um, <laughs> whatever. I guess whoever was looting it didn't have time or something, but... You know, it's... We're up, you know, we're... It's like a casino. We're up right now. We can keep gambling or we can cash out and do something else. Let's see, I don't have shield debuff, so we're, we're good to ride back out once again. Once again, here we go. Adventure number three, okay. Venture 1 was a was a failure. We got murdered by multiple people and um, our exits were all cut off. Okay, adventure number 2 was a success. We stumbled upon some dead bodies with some loot and uh, we were able to get it back home thanks to the teleport feature, which I still believe should not be in the game. That is, it kills the spirit of Albion Online. I'm just serious. Okay, here's a guy. He's out here by himself. He's mounted. He's doing something. He's got a crossbow. He's, uh, he's also got really high spec. <laughs> What is this spec at? Yeah, it's 101, huh? Yeah. Oh, we got a guy. What's he What's he got? Now, see, these guys, if they dismount and want to fight me and I happen to win thanks to lag or something, then I have... He has everything to lose if he this guy fights me, right? Whereas I, I, I got, what, like 40k? I'm going to chug a potion. That's going to make it 30k. It's, uh... It's really foolish for geared players like that. Okay, now that my loot bag disappeared, so I guess... I guess they took it all, but that's fine. We're gonna ride. We're gonna ride left. We're gonna take the left road. I know I'm a right road guy, but um, we're gonna take the left road just this once. Don't tell anybody. Here we go. But yeah, YouTubers that do like the solo PvP clips and stuff, they take so so long to make those videos because 
it's really hard. At least I find it's really hard to find fights. Like, I, I, I don't know, man. I don't know if there's just a secret that they know or are some of them staged. I mean, you know, I recently, like, there was a YouTuber I watched. He's a Rust YouTuber. I'm not going to name his name because some people might also be his fans and then start lashing out at me if I speak ill of their savior, their great and wonderful Rust YouTuber. But it's a Rust YouTuber I watched for a very long time, for like, I don't know, like three or four years. And he recently came out and demonstrated that he faked his videos, that they're, they're all staged, they're all actors, and uh, everything in them was just made up for fun. So essentially he was just directing a fake, like like reality TV of sorts. I, I don't know how to describe it, but that kind of I don't like that kind of stuff. I don't like fake footage. I don't like fake acting, and it was really upsetting too because a lot of his stuff looked really legit, and I was fooled. I thought he was legitimately going in solo on these Rust servers and doing the things that he did and having the reactions that he got, but apparently not. So upsetting. So of course, you know, I have to click that you know that button and uh, just just give up watching, man. Like this is. Totally going the wrong way from where I wanted to go, but I guess we'll take a detour. You know, that's part of the adventure. Is it's gonna unshield me here? It's fine. Uh, t taking a little detour. Well, I'm not cleaning up the trash this time. <laughs> Just taking a little detour. There's a little something going on there. Oh, okay. Here's a guy. He's he's red though. This guy is attacked recently. Bolt casters. High spec on his armor. He's got the damn shield helmet. I don't. Sated Chase, okay, let's uh, how experienced are you at fighting my man? You got lots of assists there on your recent kill yesterday. So this guy's got friends. He's got friends uh, Looks like yeah, he's got lots of friends. Here they are. Here they come <laughs> Oh boy, let's get them <laughs> So we're gonna practice running away here by going invisible and then running fast Okay, and then going invisible again and trying to eat our stew so they can't have it, and then running away. Uh, because obviously I can't kill this many people, but I can at least eat all the damn food. And uh, is that bolt caster gonna kill me? Probably. And there's nothing I can really do here, so I'm basically dead, but they didn't get the stew and they didn't get an invisibility. Well, they got one invisibility potion. So uh, yeah, uh, inspecting a guy following you. Oh, he's got friends and he, he kills, yeah. All right, well that was adventure number three. That's a loss. I think we're down again. I think we're down, guys. Uh, let's see. Let's buy another set and get back out there again. 40k. Let's go. That's the buy-in, you know, for the for the gambling, for the table. You can see, that's why I don't bring the cape. That's why I don't have a, a bag or an offhand. That's why. That's why, guys. Like, it's that simple. And I have yet to catch someone out by themselves. Alright, so enjoy the... For like, how many people did I die to there? Let's see. I died with four assists. <laughs> I think it was more than that, but that's the only ones that actually managed to tag me. It looks like I'm being followed now by three dudes. So that's cool. Um, <laughs> you know, the mule does make you a target. It does make it harder to run away, however. Um, on a horse, you're still going to be chased down by swift claw users, and on a swift claw, you're going to be chased down by direwolf users. It's just the, the circle of nature or life. And if the mobs tag me, they're pretty much going to get me. Let's see, are they, are they st are they still following or are they circling back around? Yeah, there's a blob. Oh, no, the blob's going the other way. I think we're okay. Someone killed those animals recently. That's a, that's a good sign. However, it's too close to this damn hideout or whatever this is called. I don't know what this is called, like fort? Oh, there's a player. Spear, jack. Oh, hey, look at that, invisibility. Nice. Cool, I'm gonna drink a potion. I'll see you later. Okay, boots into invisibility again. Just run the other way, just juke them. Oh, look, let's just run into the blob. Fuck it, look at him. <laughs> Why do people tell me to go to the black zone to eat the stew? You can't have it, it's mine. Yo, you, I, I mean, if you want to dismount on me, I'm going to shoot at you. I'm dead anyway. I'm literally fucking dead anyway. So how many assists are you going to rack up before you kill me, though? <laughs> Oh, you died. No shit. <laughs> this is the reality of the game that no one else is going to show you guys. This is the real black zone. This is this is how it is. This is ex <laughs> This is the truth of the game. This is why people stop playing this shit. 
Because every every guide is like, go to the black zone and farm. Okay. Goes to black zone, gets killed by how many people? How, how many assists do we get on that death? We got four. Four again. There was way more people than four, though. And yeah, I could go out different gates and take different routes to Arthur's Rest until I find one that works. But, um... Yeah, I think, uh... <laughs> I normally have way better luck when I'm not recording, I swear. I'm not... I'm not playing this up, but yeah. It's your it's your fault because you're wearing a donkey. It doesn't matter. that How many players were coordinating against me there? Like, I'm going to remove my shield. There's someone near me. Look at this. I'm getting the, the, the warning that someone's near me because they're invisible. Anyway, I took my shield off, so now they can radio in their Discord. Hey, it's Swoop Ninja again. He's got 40k worth of loot on him. Oh, my God. So if I drink one potion, right, um, that makes it, what, 11k? So that's like 30k if I eat the, the stew that brings it down to like 27k. So they're getting 27,000 per kill. <laughs> it's like, I don't know, looting a chest in a yellow zone dungeon. It's not a lot. It's really not. Oh boy. And I can't even go up and left here. So I have to go right. Which means, yeah, reset camera. Then I gotta take a bunch of lefts. We'll do it though. These, these little cages, why don't people break these? Like... I need to get a demo hammer to break them. Why not? Make that a video. Hey, I went to the black zone and broke everyone's stupid crap. There's a lot of people dying up there. And I'm curious. I want in. I want in on whatever they're doing. Dark Lord Nuts and Undead M McCree. Ooh, that's... McCree got renamed, didn't he? Yeah. And then Izin Zip Zap. That's three people dying in, like, quick succession. So there might be some loot to get. Someone might be wounded. Probably not, but... What is this three icon? Oh, it's my respawn timer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, fuck. Alright. So what we're gonna do is dismount off their screen, hopefully, maybe? If they're not ESP hacking, that's a thing, too. Little ESP hackers. I'm looking for that. I'm looking for nameplates. I don't see any. They already moved on? They, they completely cleaned the bodies, too. Look at that. Well... I won't be able to loot this for, what, yeah, 30 more seconds. Oh, there's a body. He's he's on his mount, though. I, I can only do this trick for dismounted players, and now they're going to follow me. And what what's they got, what do they got? They got nature? <laughs> oh, I guess they saw, you know, maybe they saw my kit, and they were like, yeah, it ain't worth it. Ain't worth it. But yeah, <laughs> so you want to know how that claw guy got me in the previous death? So the way it works is you sit dismounted at a choke point and you turn your volume all the way up or you just have a friend like that he did in Discord that will tell you when someone's approaching. That's another way to do it, obviously. But you would sit at a choke point like this and you have your volume all the way up and as soon as you hear the sounds of a mount, you hit your invisibility. And then whenever someone approaches, you can attack them from surprise. There's a dismounted player. Let's go. This guy uh, saw me, though. These two guys have seen me. So... We're gonna try for this dismounted player. Let's go. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready for it. Oh, baby. I'm waiting for the stacks. And let's go, let's go. He's already, oh no, he fucked up. That's okay. Oh, he's invisible and I'm getting shot by the guards. I didn't factor in the guards. I'm, see, I'm hurting him, man. He's got a tier 8 kit, too. 3k HP. I'm doing pretty... I'm not going to survive this, by the way. He's, he's totally going to kill me because of the guards. But I just wanted to show you guys. That's what it's supposed to do. So I'm going to get down here. And because he's part of this group or whatever, this um, watchtower stuff. Um, really? Am I going to be allowed to stand back up? No, he's coming. Okay, there you go. But I, I just wanted to show you. That's what it looks like. Obviously, his gear was too good. And he's got the guards, you know, like simping for him. So... <laughs> I don't know what this video is. I'm sorry. I wanted to make something more of a win, but it's it's not working, man. But yeah, I I just paid what 30 30k because I didn't even eat the stew. <laughs> the stew really makes a power difference. Um, but that that's how the gank works. That's how invisibility ganking works. It's it, you can profit off of it if um, you know if we did this all day. Eventually, I'm gonna get a big win, like a big jackpot. You know, pop some big juicy and. <laughs> Uh, now, I'm still not taking invisibility because, again, like, I can't gank anyone in the first two maps if I do. 
But again, like this guy, boom, scouted. Here comes everybody else. You know, they just follow you because oh, he's on a donkey. That's free. You know, get him. Because <laughs> it is. It's it's literally free. I like the, uh, someone who put all these lights out here. You know, nice that they um light up the roads. It's very kind of them. Very generous. Why the hell? That's so. Why the hell is a hideout allowed right outside of the portal zones? Like, the very first zones outside should never be allowed to build hideouts on. I think that's so dumb. But, uh, it's too late now to change it, but, uh, it's whatever. <laughs> uh, hey, look at me, I have a hideout right outside the portal zone. Okay, so what do you do with that? I don't know, we just kill people. Just kill people. <laughs> Who'd you kill? Oh, I killed Soul Benji. How much you get from him? Was he full in 8.3? Nah, he's wearing flat 4. He didn't even have an offhand, what a noob! Look at these little, little buddies, little bros, they're just dead. Again, dead animals, good sign of stuff. Who is a stuff? Ooh, there's a mule there, and an omelet, and some gear. There we go, we got 17k. That's cool. That's cool, right? We got someone's broken ass loot. <laughs> 17k, man. I'm not going back to town for 17k, I don't care. Oh, I absolutely do not care. But yeah, whoever kills us gets an extra 17k. But if we make it, guys, if we make it <laughs> to Arthur's Rest, then we can break even on all the losses of today's video. Wow, 21 minutes wasted, yay, I can't believe it. I have done nothing. I have done no fame farming. I have not made silver. Ugh. That's why I don't advocate the, the red the red or black zones. Like, that's why. It's simple. It's really simple. What's the point? If you're not advancing your character, and you could say you could, you're, oh, I'm having such a great time getting killed and just marauded by tens of hundreds of people at a time. Oh boy. <laughs> hey, it's another body. Hey, there's nothing on it. The trash, though. Just some trash. People actually will load their characters full of trash to be like little loot traps. Little, little booby traps of sorts. Oh, here comes a player. Am I scouted? Is he radioing ahead? We got a bogey on our 12. 12 o'clock, coming your way northbound on road. Stone Lake Fields, right side road. Headed towards your hideout. I'm intercepting now, bogey out. I don't, I don't know code words. Hey, is this my old body? Let's see, Soul Benji, yes, that is me. I'm dead. That's me, guys. There was a skeleton in me. They did a good job of removing that skeleton. Very cool. Hey, I remember the, this this guy. He's uh, he's obviously wanting seconds. Oh, oh, you aggroed the golem, dude. Uh-oh. 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 Here comes the gank squad again. Here, here they come. <laughs> oh, boy. Let's get those golems on them. Let's see. So, yeah, this guy... <laughs> <laughs> Do I have a blob on me? Is there a fucking blob following me? That's pretty cool. Oh no, here he comes. And invisibility. Oh no, invisibility again, and he purged that too. Eat the stew, get fucked. <laughs> Hi, YouTube. Hello. <laughs> How many we got? One, two, three, one, two, three. Yeah, there's too many, dude. <laughs> <laughs> no, I am playing a little couple hours after prime time. I lab you. Oh, you love? <laughs> I don't know. Obviously, this is not happening. How much did we burn through today? Dual me only. Weapon, 300k. He's got a 6.1 grade hammer. He's going to switch switch that to an 8.3, uh, what's it called? The dual, the, the dual wielding hammers that make you big. Yeah, that's, that's a fun scam. Don't ever fall for that one, guys. <laughs> okay. <Bye>. Last try. <laughs> uh, last try. And uh, I'm going to show you the Invisibility Shrine won't do jack. You know what? Let's let's take a big detour. We're going to go out. We're going to go out the 9 o'clock exit here. And uh, and just go north and see what happens. Maybe hug the left side for a while. We haven't taken this exit. We don't know what kind of people are hanging out. But uh, <laughs> what am I supposed to title this video? Uh, how to have a fun time in the black zone. Getting just absolutely destroyed by too many people <laughs> like i'm telling you hello hello fellow mule rider you're out here with the cursed staff that's very dangerous but i'm telling you like <laughs> 
it doesn't matter how geared if i was in full 8-3 with the fastest mount possible i'm still dying to that i'm still getting killed by that you can't outrun the radio you can't outrun the discord call oh there's a dismounted guy and he's fighting he's fighting something Ooh. now he's he's near one of these stupid things and he just mounted up i need to find people that aren't near those dumb camps and he's also following me based on his move speed slightly uh, okay, so if we go that way, that intercedes us with the other map that we keep dying on. So we'll go left. We'll just we'll just hang left for a while. See what kind of adventure that takes us on, right? Uh, look at my respawn timer. Five or more. It is uh, four minutes. I don't have a hideout, though, so I don't really care. It doesn't really apply to me. There is an enchanted body there. That means someone's going to come back and skin that again. That's a good little campy spot. Just got to find someone. Preferably someone not tier 8 gear who can... Run to the guards. <laughs> oh no, I'm in a guild in this area. Help me, my guild. Help me, my guild guards. I am so glad that I bend the knee and submit my will to to be part of a giant zerg. Ooh. No one skinned that saber tooth. That's a shame. Big shame. Oh well, it's fine. It's just tier 5. It's whatever. Look, look at that. They lit up the roads. How kind. How awesome. Look at these statues. Why do people just dump statues in the black zone? I guess, I guess it's their territory and they're like, yeah, we're just going to put it down. Like, maybe it's to disrupt bots. Like, if you're a bot, you get stuck on the little decorations here or something. I don't know. I don't know the purpose. Maybe it's strategical. Ooh, what do you got? You are, yeah. Yeehaw, partner. Far Shore Lagoon. Yep, I'm gonna go down to the old watering hole at the lagoon. Well, so far so good, I guess. We're just kind of moseying along. And yeah, I could make the silver back. If I stopped and killed the mobs, like each of these mobs, even without premium, are gonna drop over a thousand silver. So I just kill 40 mobs and I get my silver back. Or I can go tier 8 zone, kill like, a f you know, like 15 mobs, get my silver back. I, d I don't really care. <laughs> it's 40k. I make like 2 million just clicking for 5 minutes on craft. It's... It's not bad, man. I just find it. How many, how many, uh, <laughs> that last death. How many assists? Two? Oh, bullshit. Two, two on that one also? Really? Really? And, uh, that one, four. Yeah, it's been, like, two to four, even though there's, like, plenty of people that don't even bother dismounting. They're like, ew, flat four? I don't even want to, I don't even want to put that in my inventory. That's dirty. That's gross. That's nasty. All right. Hello, scout. Who, uh, yep. Hello, scout. Let's see what happens in the tunnels. There's always an invisible guy in the tunnels waiting to jump you as soon as your shield pops. There's another, oh, yeah, here, here he comes. Oh, I still have my shield up. Sorry, bro. Sorry, dog. I should, you know, like, these guys are all together. So it's basically, I can fight the one claw guy, the other two jump me. Or they just follow me from zone to zone. You can't run from the, <laughs> the, the wolves. Uh, oh, did you zone in? Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Hey, there's that. Hey, that guy is worth more money than me. You should go after him. Yeah, see this guy? Look, look. He's got some good stuff. Go after him. Is he, are any of them mounted? It's hard to see with all the damn life bars. Okay, we're going to go with Mr. Flow here. Ilm Flow. Look at all the people. What the? What's going on? Maybe they have a war to run to. These guys are from Chips. They're they're traveling in a in a pair in a duo, which you know, uh, traveling in, in groups makes them stronger, I guess. Or if that claw guy's still here. Yeah, uh, I guess he mo moseyed on. Maybe he saw that my gear was shit. You know, some people they don't want to invest the time when they they can gank a fatter target. What? Okay, so they just turned around for some reason. I wonder what their ESP hacks are telling them that that I don't I can't see. You know, uh, I guess nothing. <laughs> uh, weird. I don't know. People are just doing whatever. Far Shore Dry Lands. All oh, these lands are so dry, bro. So dry. This guy looked like he was dismounted for a sec. Maybe not. I don't know. Maybe my brain is playing tricks on me. But, you know, we, we found one guy that was mining so far in 29 minutes. And people are like, why don't you make PvP videos, bro? <laughs> But this is why. This is fucking why. <laughs> you can't find solo players in the black zone. Just go deeper, okay? Yeah, just go deeper. Just avoid all the kill squads. <laughs> oh fuck, man. I'm telling you, it's wild. You could you could go in this group dungeon. There could be people in there. Yeah, there could be like ten people in there and seven point one ready to just destroy me. 
what am I going to do? Just magically luck out like certain certain streamers where everyone's just down from a bad boss and you can just execute all of them and take their loot and then later, you know, uh, get on Discord and pay them their fair share for being a cool actor. Yeah, I can I totally arrange fake little uh, <laughs> encounters for for stream, you know, ab, you know, entertainment. No, I'm not gonna do that. I'm I've always been real. I'm the real OG, <laughs> the real slow bingy. Oh man. Well, this was a nice. Oh 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 oh! That guy's this. Oh, he's wounded too. Dang, dang! What's he doing out here, man? Uh, riding towards him sus as hell. Okay, yeah, you, you got a juicy weapon, I could take you, but you also, uh, I don't know, whatever. Well, we missed our opportunity, but the thing is, you have to find someone that's, like, busy. Oh, here we go, we got a bunch of people riding towards us here. Very cool. Now, what do we do? we just been spotted by, like, four guys. Obviously, our gear sucks. Ooh, here, body. Ooh, body, yeah, loot. Uh-huh. Woo, nothing on it. And yes, I, I'm aware that checking the bodies gets rid of my shield. I know this. I don't care. It's fine. Remember, it's a 40k set. I'm going to be chugging, like, the potion eating the stew. Just so that my my killers don't get all the... This is going to dismount me, by the way. Here we go. We're dismounted. Cool. So someone can ride up and murder us now, which is awesome. If they do dismount on me, I do get that little, you know, bonus time. So at this point, do you dive into a dungeon and wait for the 20 seconds, or you just keep walking? Fuck it. I don't have a kit worth saving. <laughs> oh, d there we go. We, we, got a, we got a guy. I went invisible. Did he see me, though? Did he? Oh, oh, oh. This might be it, guys. This might be it. Yes. He has no mana. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Booyah! We got a kill, baby! Woo! <laughs> yeah, man! We st oh, hey, don't kick me. I'm looting. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, I can finish you off! Get some fame! Yeah! Kablamzo! Boom! Look at that. We even killed the dude. And he's gonna drop loot for us, too. You winkers! Alright, we just made 75k. That's pretty cool. We can continue along to Arthur's Rest and try to bank that shit, or we can just teleport home. I think we'll just teleport home. Hey, there is a chest nearby. Three minutes. I can't teleport home because I'm an outlaw. So, we'll just dive into a dungeon. And then we'll wait that outlaw out, and then we'll teleport home. Simple. Simple as. Let's check the mobs. See if there's someone in here. We could we could go for double. I do have another book. Okay, there's mobs. So, clearly, there is not a player in here unless I skipped the opening mobs. But there we go. Our outlaw status is now, well, two minutes still. <laughs> uh, how close am I to Arthur's Rest? Oh, I'm like two zones away, dude. I'm like two zones. I could go for it. I could seriously go for it. Did I get his, I didn't get his mount. I got his uh, dangle mouth catfish. I don't really, I don't know. Got poison potion, <laughs> and we got a little bit more mobility if we wanted. You know, we could we could try. Uh, let's let's replace our boots. Don't put the cape on. Let's see. We'll put on the offhand. Why not? Why not? Right? Might as well. Might as well put that to use. So what do we do here? It's se look. It's seventy k. I don't give a shit. It's seventy plus like thirty k. My kit is now worth thirty five. So I'm I'm worth one hundred five k. If I get this shit to Arthur's rest, it's worth way more. And it's pretty... Why do I keep freaking mashing buttons? It's like two zones away. <laughs> also, there was that chest nearby that opens in three minutes, right? We could try for that. You know, Outlaw's only got like 50 seconds remaining on it. Or we could teleport home. This video is kind of long, but we did... Man like, this is how long it took. If I was a YouTuber who focused on PvP footage, showing off the invisibility gank bullshit that I did... It would. It took 34 minutes to get that footage, to get that one clip that lasts like 20 seconds, and I'm su I'm somehow supposed to turn that into an eight minute video, because if it's not eight minutes, you don't get paid. It's. <laughs> oh, what's the math on that? That is crazy, isn't it? And and like it wasn't even a big haul. It's just some flat five stuff, you know. It's whatever. <laughs> All right, let's. Uh, we got 10 seconds on outlaw. Let's go ahead and get out of here. Let's check out that chest nearby. Let's see if anyone's there. 
That chest opens in one minute. That is risky. That is risky. Okay, Outlaw. Outlaw's done. Let's just teleport home, bank this stuff, and then we'll just... It, it's still a loss of silver. It's still a big loss, but you can see here. It's really cool. You have a kill, and you don't have any assists, and uh, it's kind of it's kind of goofy looking. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, anyway, uh, <laughs> I'm Swole Bidgey. Thanks for watching. Uh, I don't know what this video title is going to be. Um, videos every day. Make sure you leave a like. I read every comment, so... Come on, leave me a comment, I'll read it. I may not reply to it, but I, I will read it. Okay, guys? Ah, oh, jeez. Uh, if you want to donate, click the Thanks button. It really helps me out. You can also become a channel member. It's five bucks a month. Click the Join button for that. Check out the pinned comment for a playlist of all the members-only videos that you get access to. If one of those interests you, feel free to become a member. It really helps me out. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope I hope you... Hey, stop healing me. What are you doing healing me? Hey. Oh, I got a little... <laughs> a little laser beam. Anyway, thanks so much. I will see you in tomorrow's video. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss it, okay? Take care. Hopefully it's more useful than whatever this video was.